morning folks leader divinity as you know now in today's topic i'll be telling about the pineal gland as the waking and sleeping cycle of the human body now you need to understand what the pineal gland is the pineal gland is a peanut sized cone shaped purple purple colored organ inside the brain right here inside the brain almost in the center next to uh, the hypothalamus so the pineal gland acts as a waking and sleeping cycle for the body. Now you need to understand what this means. This means that the waking and sleeping cycle is controlled by the circadian rhythm. And you understand that everything that's in the brain, the eyes, the nose, the mouth, and the ears, is one thing. They're all connected to the information that's going to the what? Your thoughts. You understand? So once you understand what the pineal gland is, it's controlling the body's waking and sleeping cycle meaning that your thoughts of waking and sleeping meaning that when you're thinking and when you're not thinking when you trigger thoughts and you not trigger thoughts the pineal gland controls how your thoughts are going to engage with the body through its own circadian, circadian rhythm what i mean by the circadian rhythm i'm talking about the states of emotions when i talk about the body's waking and sleeping I'm talking about the state of emotions of the human body based on this place called earth and what this place does to the human body so the pineal gland is purple the crown chakra is purple so once it's you your blood is your your electromagnetic frequency is vibrating at this frequency of the pineal gland what happens is your thoughts remember your brain is programming your, your thoughts right the brain is programming your mind so your thoughts connect with the intention of a human being's mission and the state of mind that it collects the information about this place remember there's night and day these are part of the waking and sleeping so there's the there's the subconscious and the conscious part of you as well this is what the pineal gland actually talks to through the body so the electromagnetic frequency beams via the eyes to the brain and hits the pineal gland cones and the pineal gland just vibrates and when it vibrates you know that this human entity is tapped into its part of itself that is subconscious or conscious now when we talk about those, those conscious and subconscious minds we're talking about the parts of the brain that are going to make the human entity body go to its physical thoughts or its spiritual thoughts you understand so you both your hormones and your blood are going to be part of the circadian rhythm of what this human is thinking about based on what this human is actually intending to do with the mission do you know what you're here for if you're going to work your subconscious mind is being programmed on a nine to five system for example if you're an artist if you're doing your own thing your subconscious mind is controlled by your own hormonal interactions of what am i doing what do i want you understand so you can tap into your higher self as a god but without being controlled uh, through your, your conscious mind that's what uh, a person who's elevated inside the so the pineal gland works for the thoughts as well it gives you your day's thoughts through the electromagnetic frequency as i said so once this electromagnetic frequency is dispersed it creates thoughts in the brain these thoughts are connected to nature when i say nature i'm talking about nothing the darkness so if you're not creating your thoughts for example you're following just people's thoughts and advices your circadian rhythm subconscious is not even creating thoughts it's just living inside already given thoughts you understand so once you understand that this thing this this pineal gland is actually a waking system to your own subconscious so that you can control your subconscious through your conscious thoughts so every time you're thinking you're sending light into the body through the brain so your blood your dna which is a software that creates the hologram of your own imagination of you being here is created by light which is the pineal gland it's so small like this cone shaped but it can destroy everything it can create everything within the human body so you need to understand how powerful this thing is it's so powerful it's so dope when i talk about the controlling the waking state talking about zeros and ones you know thinking and not thinking applying your intentions versus not applying your intentions and this now makes you the super subconscious or the superhuman that you can create within the body's uh, blood system you understand so the body the human entity this thing is nothing but the pineal gland's 
connection to its conscious via the subconscious of its waking state of this dream we're in we're in the most conscious dream this world is the most conscious dream you understand this is the most conscious dream you can have this one is the most conscious dream and it's controlled by the pineal gland you understand how the sun is so small and it looks so far but yet it's powerful and it's uh it's making all this place bright the whole world just the small small sun small little dot small little white dot or yellow dot but it's sparking the whole entire globe that's exactly how the pineal gland works it's a small little piece size cone shape but it's amplifying or charging the whole human body based on its own understanding of what's happening here so those thoughts are gonna wake 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 up the god realm inside you you know the melanated part the, mel the melanocytes they're gonna be hit by this electromagnetic frequency of the pineal gland so these melanocytes are gonna be moving faster inside your body these are cells that work with the pineal gland so once the heat is applied which is the electromagnetic frequency inside the body the heat outside outside is the heat inside the body is the electromagnetic frequency so once it hits the melanocytes it acts on the human body and the human entity will go into its god state whether you like it or not you will enter your god state because of the hormonal changes that are caused by the frequency that you're thinking from so in this most conscious dream that we're having this earth heart feeling you need to understand it's been controlled by the pineal gland. So once you can sit here at the seat of your soul, this is where the seat of your soul is, as above, so below. As above, so below. Whatever you're sending through your brain as an answer controls the, mag the magnetism of all the organs and all the chakra system, the, the energy vortex that's spinning inside these this, this, uh, organs, you know, your pancreas, your thymus gland, these are spinning energies inside. So once they hit by the electromagnetic frequency of how you're thinking, they, they send energy there and your state your state goes higher you go from your conscious to subconscious to super conscious that's the awareness of its own state that's where the entity knows that it's having a dream it's imagining itself here when i'm talking about the most conscious dream i'm talking about you having an imagination of yourself being here the most conscious dream ever and waking up to that is waking up to your god state right this is the black sun happy sunday enjoy know about the pineal gland the circadian rhythm and the waking and sleeping state of the body right stop thinking with your feet stop thinking with your blood start thinking with what the seat of the soul this is where the seat of the soul is anyway it's the black sun you know love and light enjoy your day